hey YouTube opinionated reviewer here and as some of you guys know I did a video a couple of days back probably a week and a half or two weeks ago about how to get iOS 5.0 beta on your iDevice without having a registered UDID but after some of you did that you probably realized that you couldn't sync your songs with iTunes you couldn't use iMessage multitasking and you didn't get service on your phone all of that good stuff you couldn't you didn't get it well today I'm gonna show you guys how you can activate all those features and still not have to pay anything or register your UDID now the only downfall to this is you're gonna have to be jailbroken so I'm gonna have a, if you want to do this I'm gonna have an annotation on the screen showing uh, my snow breeze jailbreak for iOS 5.0 beta and my red snow jailbreak for iOS 5.0 beta videos and after you jailbreak using either one of those tools you're gonna have to get in again like how I showed you in the iOS 5 video when you triple tap the home button you can just go back and watch the video I have a, a, a in-depth written tutorial with the link will be down below to that so now I'm gonna show you guys what you have to do to get this working so you're gonna need win SCP or cyber up for Mac so after you jailbreak you can use iFile also you can in install iFile after you jailbreak or you can just use op install open SSH and use cyber up or win SCP so whichever one is more convenient so you're gonna after you end there you're gonna go and navigate all the way back you're gonna hit sys, you're gonna navigate to system, libraries, core services, and you're gonna open up this file at the bottom, the system version dot plist file. You're gonna open up that. And you see these two lines at the bottom right here. I have them highlighted, these two lines. You're gonna delete those two lines and then you're gonna click save. So after after you delete those two lines, you're gonna you're gonna make sure you save it and then you're gonna reboot your iDevice but remember the jailbreaks are tethered so you have to boot with Red Snow or iBooty depending on which jailbreak you did after you reboot that you are just gonna have to sign in with your Apple ID and everything should be working you should have service on your iDevice you should be able to sync with iTunes and all that good stuff iMessage and all that good stuff I've known this for a couple of days now but I wanted to test and make sure that it was working before and credit to send for iPhone repo and missed app cash for the help so I hope this work for you guys and everything is working you can have all the features and still not pay to register your UDID with that being said please rate comment subscribe have a nice day I